Hassan, for more fun with Sadis. So, um, Anna, can you read the sentence for me up here? Um, why do I need to read it? Well, I know, I know that you're fluent, and I know that you speak Spanish at home, but I need you to show me that you can comprehend this and you can read it. I don't really want to read it. Like, I don't know what the point of reading that sentence is. I speak Spanish at home all the time. Every single day I speak Spanish. I don't know why I have to read that Okay, well, okay, aside from the sentence, tell me one place in the whole world that you want to travel. You want to go somewhere. Mm -hmm. Tell me. Cuba. Okay, so you want to go to Cuba. First of all, why do you want to go to Cuba? Oh, because I learned something about the history of it, and I think it's really interesting, the whole revolution stuff. Okay, right. So you see something about Cuba, you see something about this foreign land that really interests you. It makes you feel, something in you feels really attached to it. Yeah. You want to go see it. When you get there, you start speaking to people, they can tell that you're a native speaker. Yeah. And you're going to not have a problem, right? So why do you have to be here? What about when you go into the store and you're trying to buy something and you can't read the sign? You can't buy your uh, fancy little outfits to go uh, dancing out in. You can't go to the restaurant. You can't read the menu. People are going to look at you like you're crazy because you can't read. You can speak it perfectly, but you can't read it. Well, maybe I can ask. I mean, I would look kind of stupid, though. But you're already here. You're already in this class. Here I am. I'm so excited. I can't. I want to go to Cuba myself. I want to go to Argentina. I want to go to Colombia. Mm -hmm. I want to go to so many places. And in order to do that and be there and be respectful of their culture, I need to learn about their culture here in the classroom, from the books, from video clips, from other people I can speak to. It's so much bigger than this sentence right here. But I'm going to get you through this sentence. We're going to read it together. And you can do this. I know that you can do this. So why don't you work it out slowly with me. How about you start with this first word? Um, that's a V, so we know that it's a B uh, sound. Va. Vai. Vai. Um, Which sound does this double O make? Nila. Vainilla. Nija. You see, vainilla. Vainilla is... Um, what de, de... Um... Masi... Good. Vainilla is demasiado simple. Simple. Good. So here is demasiado simple. Good. And what do you know? Do you see some caveats in there? You probably have heard these words at home. What are yeah. we talking about here? Vanilla is too simple. Good. Good. You got it. <laughs>